Hello children, in this video we are going to see the workbook exercise for the expression web4, ok? First exercise, come up with the correlation. Observe the spider's web, ok? First what is given, observe the spider's web. Second one, observe the website. Here, what is the correlation between a spider's web and a website? Okay. So far, you learnt many things about website. Right. Now, you have to think and write what is the correlation between a spider's web and a website. Second exercise, expand mean. First question, HTML. What is the expansion of HTML? Yes, hypertext markup language. Why is some text on a web page termed as hyperlinks? What is special about those texts? The answer is, hyperlink is a link reference to data for user. Because it suggests additional content. One second I will repeat. Hyperlink is a link reference to data for user because it suggests additional content. If you want you can write this answer otherwise you can write it by own. Third question. What are the various versions of HTML known to you? Okay. I will say few versions. If you know more than that you can write. Okay. HTML 1.0, HTML 2.0, HTML 3.0, etc. Okay. So, if you know more than that, you can write. Next exercise, help me find the right tags. Here the first one, the text between dash and dash describes the web page. What is the answer? You have to write the correct tag. Yes, the first one, HTML tag. That is starting and the ending tag. Okay. Second question, the text between dash and dash is a visible page content. The answer is body tag. Okay, beginning tag and the ending tag. I think you remember how the ending tag will be. You put slash and then you can write the body part like that. Okay. For third one, the text between dash and dash is displayed as a heading. Yes, title tag. Okay, beginning title tag and the ending title tag. Then fourth one, the text between dash and dash is displayed as a paragraph. The answer is P. Okay, within the angle bracket, you can put the starting tag and the ending tag. Next one, rebus puzzle. What is a rebus? A rebus is an allusion device that uses pictures to represent the words or parts of words. What are rebus puzzles? They are Essentially, little pictures often made with letters and words which cryptically represent a word, phrase or saying. Here one example is given for you. The first one, see the picture children? Yes, back to square one. Right? What is the answer? Back to square one. So, in the same way, you have to Think this for the second picture. If you want time, you can pass the video and think. Okay. At last, I will tell the answer. Here also, you can pass the video and find the answer. You can take it as challenge. Okay. Take time and think.
Okay. Now I will say the answer. Here the first one. Once in a blue moon. What is the answer? Once in a blue moon. Second one. First aid. Second one. First aid. Then. Third one. Overseas travel. The answer is overseas travel. Then fourth one. Split personality. Fourth one. Split personality. Then fifth one. For instance. Fifth one. For instance. Then sixth one, top secret. The answer is top secret. Then for last one, wake up. Okay, what is the answer? Wake up. Okay. Children, if you have book, you can write the exercise. The answers in the book. Okay. If you don't have your book, you can write the Answers in your rough notebook. Thank you children.